glad you saved my life. Yeah, okay, I'll talk to you all soon. Thank you. Hello, you. Forgive the mess, I haven't had a lot of time for work since we got back, and there's a lot to catch up on. Oh, you know, the usual exciting Jedi fare, the dispatches for Bacchus's transportation, security consultations. I've been speaking to a counselor as well, trying to share what we know about his emotional status. See if we can get through to him, help him out a bit. Which reminds me, they're probably going to want to speak to you as well. Are you happy for them to do that? Of course. We'll value your input. You're the one who spoke to him, after all. Fantastic. Thank you. Please make yourself comfortable. Please help yourself to anything in the biscuit tin. Now where did I put those notes? That's the meditation tomorrow. That's the... Sorry? But yes, of course I have a screen in here. Can't watch the rotunda without a screen, can I? Me and Master Levea watch it every week. Or at least we usually do. We were supposed to watch the latest episode two days ago, but somebody decided to go and get themselves captured by the bounty hunter. <sighs> no, it's fine. She's probably just watched the next episode without me anyway. So impatient for a Jedi moss. Dirt? What's this? She recorded it. <laughs> oh, Levea. You're too sweet. Hold on, sweet. That doesn't sound like you. Oh, so was there a note attached to this? Ah! Here we are. This is a one-time thing, Slowpoke. You have any idea how hard it was to record this without watching? Get back faster next time. LeVeyer. LeVeyer, you're too sweet. I'm sorry. Ah, uh, yes, I'm sorry. We were going to talk, weren't we? My mind's all over the place today. So. How are you doing? Oh, good. I'm glad to hear it. It was a daring thing you did. Bacchus is a very dangerous man. I'm impressed you were able to fight him one on one. I know we talked about it on the way back, but there are a couple of things I wanted to ask you. I suppose chief among them. You had a lightsaber at one point. But you didn't use it. You stuck to the Bible blade. Why? No. No, no. I, I think it's good. I think that's... It's a very mature thing to recognize. Should you have killed? I don't know if we should kill anyone. I don't think should is the right question. He wasn't a nice man, no. To many, his actions alone would condemn him. He was a slaver and a trafficker, and to many, a murderer. I'm glad these questions weigh on you. It's the mark of a good person. Moral certainty is a very dangerous thing, especially for a Jedi. I think you made the best choice you could. And I think that's what it comes down to in the end. You had the opportunity to show mercy without putting others in harm's way. That is a good choice to make. If he had someone else in his power, or was threatening an innocent life, then it might have been better to kill him. No. No, not right. Never right. Sometimes it is the better of the options available to us. Sometimes killing someone intent on cruelty is the best option we have. But it is never right to kill. Best, it's a painful necessity. Something that we do because we are deprived of better alternatives. In an ideal world, in an ideal universe, 
It would never reach that stage, but for all our best efforts, we do not always live in such a place. It should be painful, I believe. People say you should try to get over that pain, to work past it and realize that what you did was right. But I struggle to agree with that. I think if you've killed someone, it should always bother you. As Jedi, we can feel their connection to the Force, see the ripples of their actions and their character. We know better than almost anyone that the worst of men may be better if they were given the right chance in the right place. It's never a good thing to rob the universe of that. Then I suppose I am somewhat biased on that account. What do I know? Did he say something about me then? Did I know him? I suppose I did. I knew many bad people back then. Like I say, everyone has their place, everyone has their opportunities. He was a bad person who killed for money, and I tried to put that to good purpose. Was that right or wrong? I don't think I'll ever know. And maybe I shouldn't. I'm not surprised he mentioned enemies I might have. I don't expect everyone to forgive who I was. Some will always feel that I got off too easily from what I've done. I made my choices. And they're not wrong to feel that way. Some people I have wronged past the point of forgiveness. But I think they have a right to believe that I deserve retribution for that. I suppose if I am to face anyone's judgment, I would rather it be theirs than that of someone like Bacchus. Seems more fair. No, I've spoken very ill of the man. There's a lot to speak ill of, but... I think you made a good choice with him. I wouldn't go so far as to say that I think he's a good person, deep down, but from what you say, I think there's potential for me to be. I don't think that's naive, necessarily. I know a lot of people think so. It's kind, maybe, but even on practical grounds. What better fate is there for an enemy than to turn them into a friend? You showed great maturity in that choice, and great compassion, and I am proud of you for that. Oh, that reminds me actually, uh, would you mind going to the, uh, the cupboard at the back? I think I have a box of Trandoshan fudge somewhere. I have a bit of a craving. Yeah, it should be at the back, just rummage around a little bit. A uh, large black box? That's the one. Bring it here. <laughs> it's very exciting, isn't it? Go on, open it up. Oh, no, that's not right. That doesn't look like fudge at all. No, that looks like a lightsaber. Yes, it looks a little bit like your one, doesn't it? Do you want it back? Oh, yes, of course. You've done more than enough to earn it, if you want it back. No. No. No, 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 no. None of that. No insecurities, no doubt. You will not fall back into bad habits. I am quite certain of that. It's yours, if you want it. You've done more than enough to earn it. Good catch. Yes, if you want it back. However, there is another path we could take. You can keep the lightsaber, or we can strip it down. 
and from it build something new. What would you say to that?